freak. What are you doing? What do you think I'm? Next year, I will be. Frequency vibrations. Well, you know that little dance he does? He came out doing that. Freaking and vibing? Oh, my goodness. Freaking and vibing. Yeah. He, uh, he was running from the time he was nine months old. I mean, really, the boy didn't crawl. <laughs> he skipped that and went right to running around and getting into everything. He actually became, I guess, like a neighborhood mascot, you know? People were really proud of him. They come to the game. Welcome, college basketball fans. This is where you want to be, right here on 2K Sports. Some great action ahead, and we're happy to have you here along with us for the ride. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. We'll see the UCLA Bruins and the Georgetown Hoyas. There is no feeling like a packed house on a college campus. You can just feel the electricity in the air as two major colleges go head to head on the hardwood. And even though this game isn't a must-have game, it feels like a tournament game, a one-and-done type situation. Both of these programs know that a win here could be huge for them as they get ready to make a run in March. Now look at UCLA's starting line. Free out there with Fresh. Then there's Campbell, and it's Roberts in at the five, roaming the paint. And you see a lot of players who are very talented play with a me first approach that is not the case with freak he doesn't try and attract any unnecessary attention and just focuses on playing his game yeah I like that about him Greg I mean in a day and age where most guys are self-centered and it's all about me it's refreshing for a player like freak who doesn't invite that kind of noise I mean that's as impressive as a skill set really strong rebounding on the interior and he gets the easy putback. Well, UCLA and all those incredible national titles in men's basketball, Clark, they were the program in the 60s and 70s. Yep, completely dominated the landscape of college ball during that time. From 64 to 75, they won 10 titles in 12 seasons. And it's the Bruins with the ball, following the miss by Freak. Looney passes to Campbell. Here's Roberts, off target from outside. He certainly didn't take advantage of the poor defense, but they can't count on him to continue missing. I tell you what, I think he'd be happy if he could continue to get looks like that. And he gets it to go. <laughs> well, Merry Christmas. I mean, that was a freebie. Free passes to Fresh. Here's Campbell. Terrific design on the pit foot, and he lays it in. Another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively so far. 
Yeah, and I, I think we're going to see them operating a lot of their offense from the interior today. Both teams deciding to change it up. Now the Hoyers with it. It's a five-point game. Harkless with the buckets. Boy, that was a rugged screen set there, fellas, and the defense didn't even try to go through that one. Starks outside. A floater. Johnson kicks to Morris. Here's Looney. Can't hit from 12. You know what? Those are shots you just hate to miss when you get those kinds of bunnies on a possession. So on the floor for UCLA, we've got Starks. Looney out there with Johnson. And it's Morris in at the three. Starks kicks to Barton. Here's Johnson. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. I love the low post attack on that one. Now Harkless on the line. The rebound by Johnson. Well, there, there have been a lot of great players out of Georgetown over the years, most of them big men. But don't forget about Allen Iverson. He might just be the most popular former Hoya of all time. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. That's right. Five of their last six makes were on the interior. They've established their inside presence. Starks dishes to Barton. Here's Johnson. Knocked loose. And that's out of bounds. UCLA will retain possession. Hello and welcome back. This is College Basketball on 2K Sports. And if you're just tuning in, this is Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg as we get set for the second half. And guys, without a doubt, it's been a rough go so far here for Freak and his team. They just can't find anything to capitalize on consistently thus far. And Greg, I'm anticipating plenty of adjustments from the coach, but I tell you what, when it comes down to what happens in the second half, it's about the players executing. A few quick baskets right out of the gate, and it's anybody's game. Taking a look at the Hoyas, Freak in its center. Price is out there with Warren. That's Trice, and it's... 